Hey guys, welcome back to Kerbal Space Program, and we are here with Bobby, Wise, Cody, Lisa, Travis, for uh, what trip good to Minmus is, is the short and longer it. Um, yes, this looks like some sort of terrible, terrible version of the Eagle from Space 1999. Why not? But I figured I'd make a lander which can carry a decent-sized actual rover and take us to another moon, Minmus, which is further away than the actual moon. Mimus is out here, so it should be fun. Okie dokie dokie dokie. Let's get ourselves on route to Minmus. Like I was saying to you guys a minute ago, I decided to basically do this one from orbit because it saves us time on the trip rather than having to worry basically about um, fanning around with launches. And I mean, it's, it's like five, six minutes of launch time, plus the fact I screwed up and had to send it back. And yeah, because I'm stupid. Yeah, it's all good. These guys have suffered through me building this rocket and testing center of gravities and center of thrusts and also some other things, which is why it looks a little bit weird. It looks amazing. What are you talking about? Because these four it's engines perfect. here will be our descent engines. It's perfect. It's also, probably the first, it's also probably the first lander I've ever made that will be stable enough to actually land as intended. Although I probably will use landing guidance to basically take me down to the exact spot I want rather than my usual screwed up somewhere near where I aimed. Because my control of spacecraft on landing approach is still not phenomenal. <laughs> but we are on target now for our burn now. So, so Minmus, what Minmus is off. What's yes. the um, there isn't one because Minmus is essentially a second moon. It's just a moon that's further away. Weirdly enough, it's easier to get to than the actual moon. Why? Although, I don't know. I'm not entirely sure why, but it is actually easier to get to. And apparently it's, it's got slightly lighter gravity than the moon as well. So it's actually easier to move around on a land on. Um, whereas the moon itself is a little harder. The moon's moving faster because it's closer. Whereas Minimus being in a far wider orbit is actually moving slower. It's easier to catch it. So it's easier to catch up to it, basically, yeah. Mm -hmm. It's long and short of it. The actual... Look at how straight this line is compared to a, a Mun trajectory would basically go like this. Whereas this is almost straight. Or well, less angry. Either way, we're accelerating through space now. 700 ms to go. That should give us enough to basically circularize enough at Minmus. A lot of the reason why the requirements for Delta V is so high is because this is a fairly heavy craft. Plus, I've now gotten to the point where I like keeping my standard kind of crew capsule setup attached to it, which is my kind of SpaceX Dragon equivalent. It just means if things go horribly wrong, I can disconnect the entire nose cone of the rocket and or the spacecraft and get home. It's like having a built-in lifeboat. And it's really pretty. See, the solar panel's covering one half, radiators on the other side. Um, it works. Okay. It doesn't matter as long as it works. Yep. Landing this whole mess is going to be fun, but I also worked out how to do that too, so... Is this not... You're in career mode now, right? This is in science mode, which is like career mode without money. Because having the money as a factor is a huge pain in the backside, whereas having um, just the science to worry about is, is more fun. Because I, I did my messing around in... Um, yeah. I did my messing around in Sandbox to learn a lot of these techniques, which was fun enough in its own right, but this allowed me to actually experiment properly and learn the things I need to learn to now do it in science and actually go places intentionally. Which I think makes sense. I'm not wrong, am I? We're all being super, super quiet here in the background. Lisa chips up, but nobody else. They're in awe. You're big, big. I mean, 
I'm just observing. Damn. It, it is quite the sight. <laughs> it's terrible, isn't it? Look at it. What the best part is, this could actually... This is the bald eagle. <laughs> Because I figured, yeah, it was the eagle in space. It was the space. It was the eagle in space, nineteen ninety nine, right? Which, for those who don't know, was a British TV show by Jerry Anderson, the guy who did Thunderbirds and Stingray and everything else, uh, made in the seventies. And it was really good, actually. Obviously, nineteen ninety nine is like twenty years ago now, and we clearly have no moon base alpha and eagles that can fly from Earth to the moon and back and moon the moon. And the moon hasn't been yeeted off by a nuclear explosion into the distance, so it's quite the same thing. But um, it is also a thing. All right, so, so I think we may have an issue with our encounter here, but we'll find out. What you need to do is create a ship that looks like an eagle and fly it, right? Good. Essentially. Wait to see it. I don't think we're going to actually intercept <laughs> here. Why not? Oh. Yeah, okay. This will do just fine. Okay, we need to burn pretty quickly for this. I'm trying to adjust our initial intercept to actually, actually properly intercept. So it's a position and burn job. Yeah, okay, so that's going to put us on a trajectory to actually intersect. This is the last of our fuel we're using up here. Yeah, we're good. You're not just good, you're great. Okay, we're good. And we are basically out of gas. So it's time to decouple that and somehow try and make sense of this monstrosity. Well, you know, it, it's going to be okay because it can move in every direction. A valuable lesson was learned once. But I don't remember if it was Cayman or not. Well, we've got 2300 meters a second of fuel, so we should be just fine. Yeah, you'll be fine. What happened before wasn't Cayman either. No, Definitely. it wasn't Dota Cat no. at all. It wasn't Cayman. Nope. Now, am I going to run into Minmus is the question here. Yes! That would be hilariously bad. If your goal is to make it to Minmus, I mean, you haven't failed if you hit it. One sec, we'll get our intercept now. I don't know how much burning we have to do to actually not hit it. Okay, not bad. Not bad. Okay, so radial out. Let's see if this has realized what direction it needs to point in. I want to believe. I don't think it has. It hasn't moved, has it? Where is Minmus? Is that Minmus? Yeah. Should be the closest one right now, yeah. Oh, yeah, no, this isn't working. So we're gonna go to go normal to point in the right direction, basically. So, normal should have us in the right rough direction here. This is some calculated burnings that make no sense. Unless I control it from here. At which point, radial out is basically just right. Ooh. Yeah, that was it. <laughs> okay, we're good. Yeah, so if I control, use the lander as control because it's the right direction to the engines. It recognizes the right direction to point the engines in. Well, that is so good. fuel and uh, modern infinite wise, we're looking good here. So let's get ourselves a little bit closer. This is technically Bald Eagle 2, as the first one actually went to the Mun and crashed. But that wasn't canon. No. Oh, there's my Duna Observer probe that I left here because I couldn't get to Duna because I suck at life. It's fine. It just wanted to... It's taking just a break right there. It's all good. <laughs> yeah. Just taking a break. Got tired. Had to have a sit down. Okay, so we're pointing retrograde here. Capture should be pretty easy here. Offhand wise, do you know what minimum altitude I need to keep for an orbit around Minmus? 
Uh, you're safe. Well, I think the highest peak I'm in miss is like 15k. Well, shit. And that's like you hitting the ground. So I mean, this looks okay, right? That's I mean, those, those there, peaks must be up there. There is no atmosphere though, so you yeah. can. Yeah, as long as I'm outside of it, we're okay. Yeah. Um. What could go wrong? <laughs> Everything. He hits the Not one scary. mountain that's 15k. I mean, like we said, that counts as landing. Not the intentional kind. Well, you intend to land on it, so yes, technically. Please okay, we're good here. Please we are now circularized. So, I need to decide where I'm going to land, and I think this looks like a good idea. So, landing guidance. Please run into the We are going to land here. Yeah, let's do it. I'm using this to land me because I'd rather basically not be guitarded. Yes, yeah, so it's going to take us around in orbit first. I'm going to want to retract the solar panels just to make sure we don't derp anything. We're not going to hit anything. <laughs> And we picked a place on the light side of the planet this time, so we can come in properly. And prettily. That is the plan. Oh boy. Okay, so we are good to start our burning here. Shut up! What? You're, You're evil, Lisa. I heard you. No. Huh? I'm supporting my friend. I would rather... That doesn't sound very supportive. No, no, you, you're not supposed to hit a mountain. You're supposed to land in a crater and explode. To be and fair, yeah. hmm? I also hope you land on the mountain. Hey! Land! He said land! Land uh, very rough. What's it doing? <laughs> oh, it's confused. Moving to load the orbit burn point. Okay. Alright, so it's going to start here, I think. Yeah, retrograde. Yeah, it's going to burn us till we're coming in there. It knows what it's doing. It's got the right control point set here, so we're doing the right thing. We're basically landing there. This is going to be a steep ass approach. But it should work. But everything here should work. In theory. I hope. It almost looks like it's intended to be a vertical landing spacecraft right now. <laughs> it looks so dumb, but I like it. Oh god. Why are we accelerating towards the ground? Re <laughs> are we going to open the landing gear down? And there's no atmosphere to slow you down. Oh, that's what the engines are for. That, I'm not going to lie, that actually looks kind of badass. That looks, that looks nice. That's fucking cool. Warp one, Captain. Yes. <laughs> okay, so we're slowing down nicely. It's very heavy, which is why the engines are rioting right now. We're at 500 meters. This thing definitely wants to basically make sure it's right. I'm going to sink down here. Look at Bill! <laughs> I know, he's so happy! <sighs> Yay! <laughs> we might actually survive this. Yeah, he's like, oh my god, it's almost as though she learned oh to use the computer, therefore we're okay. Valentina's unhinging her damn dirty jaw. I know! <laughs> <laughs> She's gonna now... consume somebody. <laughs> yeah, L uh, Lenius, the new scientist I brought on board. Nerd. I figure he, he, he's like the equivalent. He, okay, so in Kerbal Space Program terms, the red shirts are anybody in a white flight suit. They are not the main four watch who wear, use the orange ones. We're good. I don't want her to watch her descent. The bald eagle has. Mm. made an intentional landing. Alright. <laughs> Look at it. <laughs> Look at that, that was buttery. Bingo. Thank you, Mech Jab. 
Okay, we have touched down on Mimus on the plains. And uh, yes, I think it is time to transfer some crew to the lander. You can fly it, baby. And we will transfer crew to lander. Okay, yeah. Oh god. Oh no, you're gonna Austin Powers it get it stuck between the two points. <laughs> I am most likely yes. No, she's fine. There you go. <gasps> yes! Oh. oh god. She almost pulled a Griswold. Uh this thing does want to tip over. I think I have to go slow AF with this thing. It does look like it has a kind of high center of gravity. It does a little bit. It makes it wiggly wobbly. But we're going it somewhere. It looks like a bus! Oh god! Space bus! <sighs> the gravity on Minmus is so much lower than it is on, Ker on uh, the Mun. <laughs> this vehicle was designed for the Mun and it, it, it is just about okay on the Mun. Whereas here, apparently, it's way too he uh, too light. No oh, gravity's just way too low. Ooh, wow. Run analysis! Uh... Cool! So, biome, great flats. We actually have our statistics run. Let's try and turn around and return to the ship without flipping this thing. That would be a nice start. The goal is to try and get across there to the edge of the hills. No, we'll stop here first. And we will get out. Valentina gets the honor of the first uh, jaunt. We'll put the ladder down first. We have boots on Minmus. Oh yeah. Yeah, girl. Strut your strut. Oh, oh god. Oh, okay. No. Oh, no. Oh, god. Apparently you can use your jetpack to get into orbit around Kerbin. Around uh Minmus. You can physically get it off the surface with the actual pack. I was actually gonna say, uh, since it has no atmosphere, can you just like keep going? Yep. Kerbex. The axes yep. are excellent. <laughs> Let's take a soil sample. Ooh. Spicy amounts of science. Let's get EVA re disarm. Hi. EVA report, not really? parachute, thank you. Let's just get some recharge done while we're sitting here. Oh, I can't operate those externally as a non scientist, so I'll get back to the vehicle. Come on, this is really light. This is hard to do anything. Oh god. Okay. So, store experiments. <laughs> Board. Let's pull this up. What's our electricity looking like on here? We're looking good, so I'll pull this back in because I've learned my lesson. Don't drive around with the solar panels open because you, you flip, things go wrong. nudge the accelerator forwards so it's not wheel okay we're wheeling we're wheeling <laughs> Do a i'm controlling jump. it no we're actually doing an intentional wheelie here because i'm keeping the throttle at the right level to keep it like this can i request <laughs> that you ramp off a mountain and do a backflip i will explode and die and i'd rather not thanks it doesn't have <laughs> to be canon just make a save and go do a sick jump i mean do a the slow of gravity no atmosphere. i mean i am going to oh i can't save because i'm moving if you do a ramp, you might actually just continue to keep on going. <laughs> that is a pro that is a concern, yes. I might just end up yeeting into oblivion. Pull an arm again. Sickest jump. I never yeah. am. <laughs> I don't want to accelerate much more in case I can't stop by the time I get to the mountains. Let's observe some mystery goo because it's mysterious and it's goo. 
Log some pressure data. Log some temperatures. It's cold. Yeah, we, we know that much. We'll take a crew report for more science. And and this is still reading the surface stuff. True. Right, I don't get any actual yeah, science from it. Dex. We did a sick flip on Minmer. Hello. It was rad. Hey, red shirt. You're probably gonna die here. Uh, Linnaeus, Linnaeus, Linnaeus. Just a random. I had to hire more scientists because uh, Bob Kerman is currently aboard my space station, chilling uh, with his snacks. That's what he does. That's always yeah. what he does. It is. Yes. He is it's my gonna scientist, get so fat that way. If I can get off this plateau and onto the edge of this stuff over here, this counts as a different biome. So we will go there. We'll then turn around, come back, and then leave. I think. Not before you make a save and do a sick jump. This is actually a. Oh god. This is why <laughs> we're making mistakes. Oh. <laughs> <Valentina is lying laughs> Can I control it? Oh. 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 I think you're making it worse. Oh. No. No. Uh. Spin it. Turn it. Turn it. Turn Bye. it. Go. There you go. You got it. You got it. We're landing. We're landing. Yeah, we're landing. Make sure uh, there's no. Uh... Yeah, there you go. <laughs> now turn the reaction wheel back down to nothing. <laughs> so you should have got some science for that. No. Oh, no. 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 We're still going. Oh, too much science. Jesus. <laughs> oh, baby Jesus, take the wheel. I'm going back to the spaceship. Screw this. <laughs> nuh uh, nuh uh. Okay, we'll, we'll take some science here because we're here. Also, I'm, I'm not going anywhere else because I'm going to die. Okay, so we're getting back to the spaceship and we're leaving. Because this turned out to be a really is. bad idea. Valentina's She's a mad woman, that's why. She's just the woman for the job. Okay, so it's I want to complain crazy. now. I got my sick jump. It was a kind of thing, yeah. It was sick. Um. What would we call this one? Don't do kick flips on a moon. <laughs> Just don't. She did a barrel roll. Parentheses always do. <laughs> well, seeing as Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 1 and 2 are being uh, remastered and released this year, kick flipping it on a mun is a good idea. No, we need to store these. So we take the experiments and we store them all to cheat. It was a kick flip and also technically a barrel roll. I can't wait to do officially supported colonies. Oh, I know. It's going to be great. Right. And I, they even rumored multiplayer. Integrated yes, support. and interstellar flight. Oh, Rachel. Me and you and Weist. Yep. Oh, I have to do I thought. Oh, they must have patched that. Bastards. Let's try and make it back to the uh, ship in one piece. No we may have to bail out on route, but we'll get there. Then we have to walk back? We'll, we'll do it. I just haven't blown it up yet. We haven't blown it up yet. We're, we're good. We're, we're okay. Honestly, I once I get back to the ship and we store the science, we're out of here. <laughs> this has been too scary an adventure. Too spooky for me. Leaving should be relatively easy, though. One Rachel, spook. why would you say that? Uh, uh, Rachel, no, why the hell did you just say that? Oh no, I jinxed myself. This is bad. Cursed. You are now cursed. Oh, damn it. Or blurst, as the kids say. Just as long as you don't go full speed into your ship, I think you're fine. Well, she hasn't done that yet, so it's got to be on the menu soon. Well, I've, I've got a plan first, so... Do we have communication to... Fuck, where's Kerbin? It's that way. Message Kerbin and tell them to hold your beer. <laughs> that fucking jump was so good. Find able to transmit, okay. <laughs> so good. 
I generally have tears in my eyes from laughing. I, I was scared. I was very scared for my own safety and survival. It was so good. Okay, we gotta slow down here. Oh, shit. Uh, <laughs> Cody called it. Uh, no. Just let slow just down. ride it out. Just ride it out. Just ride it out. Stop trying to speak. Uh. In. Ride it out, Rachel. Oh, no. Rachel, no. You should have ridden it out. Oh, what? How is it? Physics. There was no physics on the moon. Reaction wheels are inside a, a capsule, and the fact oh, that I turned the reaction yeah. wheels on to be able to save myself midair. Oh my god! Because I'm a Mace fucking break. boss. Goddamn genius! You're so smart. I wanted you to die. I know. Them. Sorry. Oh wow. <laughs> <laughs> well, not you. Just your. Specifically. Oh, I mean, I was hoping for the same thing. Chaos yeah, yeah, ray. Question is, how are you gonna get back in there? Carefully. I'm not, because I don't. I don't really need to bring it back with me, honestly. I In think fact, bringing it back this. with me is kind of useless because, I mean, you know what? Just for the sake of it, I'm gonna try. This thing. Watch this. Watch this. Uh, oh no! Get all your signs. Huh? Get all your signs. Yep. I'm so scared now. Watch this. Oh no. I always say watch this when I'm about to do something Put tremendously your... stupid. Pray to the Kerbin gods. Now she's gonna have the awesome powers to this little hole there. I'm gonna make it work, okay? Family Christmas. You tell him, Valentina. <laughs> <laughs> You're just gonna hook it up like that. What? Yep. Oh my god. That's cheating. Nope. Oh. We've been trolled. You have not been trolled. The moon, the moon we, we have indeed been trolled. No, you're not. The moon lied to me. Oh, why is your ship moving? <laughs> took control of it. Boom, so, bitch, relax. boom. Yes. Look at that. Okay, I did it. Now I have a request. Take them home like that. Leave them in the buggy. Or at least leave the, leave the science guy in there. You know, for science. Just drop them no, into- the thing's going. Drop them into the atmosphere in the buggy. It'll be fine. Yeah, see how it uh, absorbs shock. Because this whole thing is leaving here in a second. Goodbye, Moon. I mean, goodbye, Minmus. Moon, Minmus, and back. My favorite part was when she went spinny spin. Yeah, it's, it's decided to actually limit me now to a number of things. Bastard game. Damn it, damn it. Okay, so, uh, bored? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not bored at all. Trust. And you, can you be as well? Now, the takeoff from this vessel is going to be kind of meme worthy. What isn't meme worthy about this game? Please tell me. Okay, we are leaving Minmus. Oh, man, and it was a great time. Memories. Memories. Oh, fuck. <laughs> um. Fine. It's kicking it's off of Minmus. God intended. I believe the oh, wee! Hot sauce. Not See? Hot. I know what I'm doing. I am not. Alright, chat. I'm gonna need an F in chat for that dune buggy that will forever be lost. Why? May he be remembered. That was a troll. Yes, it was a troll. I ah. wanted the buggy to live. You killed her. Oh my god, you killed my spirit. God damn it. Killed Lisa's spirit animal. It was the buggy that went spinny spin. It spinny spinned its way into my heart. Well, I never said I was taking it back with me, did I? I thought you did. Did I know? You did! 
Okay, Lisa, we'll build our own space program with hookers and blackjack. Actually, <laughs> forget the space program. <laughs> Just have hookers and blackjack. You always know how to make me feel better. <laughs> uh, we should be good, I think. Because you trolled us, I now hope you all crash. We might be good. I, I hope you're know. not. I hope you're not. Hmm. I hope you're really not okay. There you go. <laughs> Shut up! No, I, I have an option if it's necessary. I don't like this option, but I have it all the same. Oh. Uh, yeah. See Rachel. those things in the middle? Rachel. <laughs> Do it. It's gonna be hairy if it works. Oh, please. Now, this is much lighter, so my Delta V back to Kerbin shouldn't be a lot, actually. Do I'm it just letting myself float okay. up here. Um. Please do it. It's it's so sick. Dude, it's gonna be it. sick. It's gonna be a yeet off into one direction. Um. Your space. Your Kerbex. You do things not well, because they're exactly. easy, but because they are sick. <laughs> yeah. Well, this is my kind of, you know, Raptor-esque vehicle. Well, not Raptor, so the, the Crew Dragon type vehicle, which I, I kind of called the Crew Sea Lion, or I don't know, like, I think of a better word. Like a Raptor is a good bird of prey. Narwhal. I'm gonna call it the, the Narwhal. Yes, the Narwhal, the, narwhal. the Crew Narwhal. That is a great name. Uh, and the really Bald Eagle, sweet. I call it some retarded names. My, my Falcon 9 ripoff is the Pigeon 9, and That's the Starship so is, of course, the Star Shit, because oh. it's very, <laughs> That's so you know. Good. Uh, right, this should get us home. In style! In but theory. Can you please do the sick thing. <laughs> We're about to yeet in a second. Why is it waiting this long? I'm confused. No, I don't want a hundred. Go now! Do it. Do it. Do it. Just, just, just go now, please. Yes, thank you. Okay. Fourteen. That's much better. Just, just yeet us. Why are we going this high? <laughs> I am the... really confused. What the heck? It's a hundred. It's going back to a hundred again for some reason. Whatever. 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 I kind of need to be into an orbit here, guys. <sighs> you know what? Oh, okay, the buggy wants now. you back. The buggy's not happy. It, Is this your idea of an orbit, Kerbal Space Program? Because you kind of suck at it. Perfect orbit. Right into that hill. That is not an orbit. Minmus demands a blood sacrifice and it will happen. I have to do everything my bloody self. That's precisely what it wants. Blood. Blood for the blood moon. There will be blood. Maybe. Probably. Okay, that'll do. Right, now we need to go home. So, uh, maneuver planner. Turn from a moon. Grid next to Please don't be a lot. Please don't be a lot. Yes. It's not a lot. We're good. 120, that's nothing. Unless that's just changing our thing, which could be a problem. Yeah, we'll be fine. Yeah, that's going to eat us off that way. I'm sad that it's good. fine. Yeah, me too. I'm not waiting here for 48 minutes, so you better decide to time accelerate. Come on. Yep, it's accelerating time now. Okay, yeet, 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 yeet. Fly around the planet. Eight minutes to go. There better be more. Come on. Faster, faster, faster. We've got places to be. This is a whole mission back and forth. Chop, chop. Come on. Please crash right at the end. Come on. No, please don't crash. Yes. Okay, it's accelerating again. Yes. In theory, Lisa I should be able to return revenge. safely from this. She will have her revenge for your uh, betrayal of the dune buggy. The dune buggy will come. Was it a betrayal, though? Why was it a betrayal? It was. Dune Why? buggy meant everything to me. We 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 reattached it. I proved the concept. It went. I never said I was taking it home. Heart, and then you broke it. But I never said I was taking it home. I said I was attaching it to prove the concept of the the crane. Never said I was taking it with me. 
the lies you tell. I know. They're terrible lies, but they're also great lies. <laughs> Crew report! Because at least I get some information back from this goddamn mission. Okay, so we're going to yeet off into the sunset here. Hopefully attached to a Kerbin orbit, which is what that should be. I'm going to come back hella faster if that's the case. Come on. Bingo! And back we come. This is going to require two small burns. Or we could just go YOLO and bring it in like this. I'm, I'm feeling YOLO, YOLO right now. I am oh. feeling very YOLO. Okay, burning retrograde now. For a hell yes, we're coming back in. Fuck the altitude. Burn. If I have enough fuel for this kind of burn. I'm not burning at the opportune time here. So we'll just go around once more. We'll stop here. And then we'll burn and this should go boop. Yeah. Cool, we're good to go. This is gonna come in fast AF, just for the record. Like this is going to be a hell spawn ride. I support hell spawn. Woo, hello, stuff. Okay. We are on approach. Our periapsis is going to be 12, so we are definitely good to go. Uh, you've been great to me, service module, but now it's time for you to go. Bye. Shit's about to get warm. I love that thing. It's a brilliant design I've made. If I do say so myself. I mean... Okay, 3,200 meters per second we're coming in at because of the angle at the steepness of our, our entry. So this is going to get hot. Uh, you're going to run into your other part? Yeah. <laughs> 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 Let's do some radial cooling as we hit the trunk section. Whoops, that wasn't planned. Should have turned around to jettison it first behind me. Let's dissipate some of this heat. We are slowing down. Nothing's fallen off yet, so that's good. I wanted her to explode and it didn't happen. I'm so sad. I know, but I'm trying, okay? No, you're this not. Is, I, I'm trying harder to I explode. don't want to explode. I want them to come home alive. God, you sadist. But where's the clickbaity title in that? Irrelevant to the adventure, kind of? Look, be happy, Lisa. It's a cat and wheel. See? <gasps> it's spinny spin! And they all feel sick now. I think Linnaeus is going to throw up in the capsule, so... Good. He's weak. He needs to learn the way. This won't eject off here yet, because we're still going too fast, so it's just sat there. Let's descend a bit. Parachutes are all set to go. We're slowing down nicely, actually. We're pretty good. When are you going to get to the point where you're, uh... Duh! Oh, no. Turns out you have to actually... <laughs> fire the parachutes. <laughs> no wish has come true. No, no, it turns out you have to press the button. I was so co focused on actually setting them to the right altitudes that I didn't. I never How did about that the even happen? Because I'm a dipshit, is how it happened. <laughs> God damn it. It's the easiest thing in the world. You press the button for the parachutes. You press <laughs> the trigger parachutes button, and when you get to the right altitude, they deploy. And I didn't bother to press it. I was like, why is this not 
do it. Oh, <laughs> shit. I basically realized what I hadn't done as it hit the water. <laughs> Is that enough of an explosion bum, for bum, you? Bum, bum. Uh, and that, ladies and gentlemen, is was a successful flight to Minmus and a return, which didn't return because I'm an idiot. They died. Is this canon? In the oceans of Kerb. Kerb I no, I don't think it's canon. What? Kerbin. Oh. Uh, no, I don't want it to be canon. It never happened again. Goodbye. Thanks for watching. Bye.